Hello, Cineos! It's Josh, and today we're going to talk about one of my favorite musical subjects, singing! I'm going to tell you about two different types of singing voice. The first is chest voice, and the second is head voice. Can you hear the difference? Chest voice is powered by a special muscle called the diaphragm. Your diaphragm is a muscle, just like your heart and just like your arm, except it's right between your rib cage and underneath your lungs. When you use it, it pushes your lungs so you can get as much air out of your lungs as possible and sing really loud. If you put your hand on your chest, you should be able to feel the vibrations of your chest voice. The chest voice is also usually lower than your head voice. All right, let's try. I want you to sing with me and sing as low as you can. Are you ready? Use your chest voice. Hello, hello, hello. Can you feel the vibrations in your chest? Let's try again. Are you ready? Hello, hello, hello. Make sure you take a big breath. Let's try one more time. Hello, hello, hello. Could you feel your chest move a little bit? All right, now let's move on to head voice. Head voice is much higher than your chest voice. And it sounds like this. Hello, hello, hello. All right, let's practice just like we did with our chest voice. I want you to sing with me. Hello, hello, hello. Now I want you to sing as high as you can. Don't scream. Try and use your head voice. Ready? Hello, hello. Awesome. Now that we have a little bit of knowledge on what our chest voice and our head voice is, we can use it in a song. This is my favorite guitar. It's a classical guitar. We're going to use it to play a song I think most of you already know. First, we're going to sing with our chest voice, which means we're going to sing it lower or as low as we can. We gotta get the jiggles out. Are you ready? It's this old man. Here we go. This old man, he played one. He played knick-knack on my thumb with a knick-knack. Paddywhack gave a dog a bone. This old man came rolling home. All right. Try and sing as low as you can. Let's do the second verse. This old man, he played too. He played knick-knack on my shoe with a knick-knack. Paddywhack, give a dog a bone. This old man came rolling home. That's about as low as I can sing it. Now, we can try singing the next two verses with our... Head voice. I want you to listen closely for if you can hear when I use my head voice. Are you ready? Sing with me. This old man, he played three. He played knick-knack on my knee with the knick-knack. Paddywhack gave a dog a bone. This old man came rolling home. Zinnias, I hope you enjoyed singing with me. I loved singing with you. Now, I want you to listen to some of your favorite songs and see if you can hear 
if the singer is using their chest voice or their head voice. Remember the differences. And for an extra challenge, try and sing with the song as low as you can or as high as you can. I would also love to see some videos of you practicing your head voice and your chest voice.